The mortals will be able to place around the track a number of large salmon. When Cockroft hits them, she will have to stop for five seconds. Yeah, so the less fish our mortals plonk around the track, the more points they can win. Let's go see how many fish the Hump has deployed to slow down our god of the game. I've decided to go for a six-point head start. The problem is, I'm quite heavy. I mean, is it too late to go on a diet? Is, is there a liposuction hospital near here? Can I nip out quickly? Well, that is proper ambitious. The Hump reckons he can beat our god with just four fish stops. Can he do it? Here he goes. And they're off! And Cockcroft is off like a rocket, powering down the first straight and into the first corner. How on earth can the Hump live with this mighty lady? He'll certainly need the help of his four fishy friends, that's for sure. And here is number one. Up it goes, and the clock is stopped for five seconds. And that lets the hump take the lead. Well, history tells us to never underestimate the hump, Dunky. We rejoin the race with one lap and two fish still to go. Well, the hump is putting some serious daylight between himself and Hannah. He is almost a whole straight in the lead. Cockcroft has some serious catching up to do. It's not over yet, but the hump is panning like an asthmatic dog. Yeah, and fee five fo fum Cockcroft can smell the blood of this Englishman. Oh, whoa, 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 look at that. She has done him on the inside. Pure genius from our god of the game. So now the hump is playing catch up. What's he got left in the fish tank? What? It's fish stop number three for Cockcroft. Can the hump make this count? Fish down! Oh, no. Well, fish on the floor, but it doesn't matter because Cockcroft is away and chasing down the hump. Can he hold on? Well, Dunky, he only has one more fish left to hold up Hannah. It is well tricky trying to overtake on these tight corners, but there are only a couple left. Can she do him on this one? It's a game of cat and mouse and fish. Oh, no, the hump has hit the wall. Yes, but Cockcroft has hit her final fish. Humpish has one last chance to be a legend. Come on! He takes the final corner as Cockcroft is released for the final time! It's going to be a sprint finish between a world champion and a 40-year-old IT manager from Bristol. This is so <laughs> close! Come on! Oh, no! But not close enough for the Humpage, who has been pipped at the post. One more fish might have done it, but ifs and buts are for losers. Yeah, here's Humpage. <laughs> It was so close, just on that final straight. You don't know just how hard it is pushing those chairs along. So next to take on our wheelchair racing god was Joe, who took an incredible head start of seven fish. Despite having to stop seven times in just two laps, Cockroft once again managed to pip our mortal in the final straight and remain undefeated. So all eyes were now on Rianne. Could she be the one to finally defeat our god of the game? So I've decided to go for three points. If this challenge was 15 years ago, I'd nail it. But yeah, my upper body strength has disappeared. Eight fish! Come on! That is a massive disadvantage for our god of the game. Yeah, you say that, but after four fish down, incredibly, Cockcroft was still neck and neck. Let's join the action on the final lap. Well, this is a right ding-dong battle. Hannah powers down the straight once again. But, oh, no, for God's sake, is another fish stop. It's not a cop, though, is it? It's a salmon, but it will allow Rianne to open up her lead. And our god is released. Cockcroft is used to racing, but this is a completely different kettle of fish, isn't it? <laughs> you get me? <laughs> the chase is on. Good cornering from Cockcroft, but this is the tricky one. And, oh, no, Rianne has balls that one right up. It's a cock-up that Cockcroft does not make. But out comes yet another pesky fish. Yep, that put her in her place. Ha! Anyway, Rianne takes the lead. She's looking tired, and as they go into the bend, Hannah is coming up her rear. Can this mortal hold on? Ha! She totally bosses that corner. Cockcroft is just behind her, but the corners are a right bugger, and she knows there are still two fish to go. And here comes one of them. Incredibly, that is fish number seven, and is yet another five-second stop. And the fish is down. Oh, the chase is on again. Here comes Cockcroft once more. This is going to be so close. Wow, and a fish. Rianne has just one corner and one straight left to go. But Hannah is free and she will hunt her down all the way to the finishing line. But it looks like he's a fish too far for our good of the game. As Rianne, all smiles, crosses the finish line <laughs> to beat Cockcroft and win three very valuable points.